just came. <laughs> so what is up guys? I'm back with another video. Um this is kinda like a little entrepreneur vlog kinda sorta. I'm gonna be doing a few things today and I just wanted to kinda show you guys. So um for one, these lashes are K World Collection, which is my business. Um we also will be launching May 4th. I'm gonna have lashes, 25mm, 3D, lip gloss, um, dang glass, oh, makeup palettes, and I have two other items that I'm waiting for that's not gonna be here till after the launch. I might, I might tell y'all what they is, but let me gloss my lips up real quick. Alright, lashes and gloss from k World collection i just need to basically finish putting the labels on my lip glosses and i need to put the labels on my lashes because this time i didn't um i didn't order my um lash labels from my vendor so they didn't put them on for me so i have to put them on myself and i also need to um i think that's it yeah that's really it I have my iPad right here and I'm pretty much digital so I'm gonna go into my app then I take notes in I'm gonna go to K-Web collection and I'm gonna go to lash catalog and right here I have all the lashes I ordered but these are um the lip glosses this is just a clear gloss with you know the oils in it and then this one has um watermelon flavor and it gives it like a little pink tint to it i will be coming out with some more colors and different flavors of course that'll be it comes in after my launch date because i thought about it after the fact but it's cool but it has key um rings so you can put on your keychain because me um i love putting lip gloss on mine so there we go so these are my lashes I decided to do um holograph little paper boxes this time because I just thought these were cute. So this time I got my labels from Avery. I had a clear transparent label and I basically typed them in. I am a little scared that my lash labels might be a little too small because in my head like when I was editing them, when I was editing them they looked it a little bigger than what I thought they would be so I sized them down so it wouldn't be too big. But I think they might actually be too small. But I'm going to still make it work. And then these are the ones right here that I'm putting on my um, lip gloss. I had put some on some lip glosses already, but I can't find it. And then these are the circle ones. Just a matte black that I'm going to put on my um, packaging in the front of it. And also, here is our new makeup palette, Holograph. Yes. I'm going to show you all it. Y'all can also go follow uh, our Instagram at K World Collection. Everything is linked down below the Instagram, the website, all that. We launched May 4th. So it has a mirror, which I love. And then these are the colors right here. And this palette is called Sunset. It has, you know, a little bit of browns, nudes, pinks, red, purple. And then it's pretty small, so like you could literally fit it in your purse, in your book sack, and it has a mirror so you can take it to go. Literally, like, it's no bigger than the size of my hand. You could put it anywhere. This is actually mine. Um, the ones I have already stored, so this is mine. All right, so let's get to work. I'm gonna go ahead and put gloves on. Because um, normally I have a different lash container, so it's like I could just open it and stick the lashes on there. But since I really have to like take every pair out, just want to be safe. I wish I had like clear and black gloves like everyone else, but I don't. To take them out the box. This is how I look. I might actually put it on the packaging because then I'm literally going to have to like take every lash out to see which one is which. Hmm. 
But what did they lose the box? And they don't know what lash is which. Is that bombshell? I'm gonna just show y'all how to do it, the lip glosses, because this is gonna take a little minute, and yeah, we ain't really got a little minute. So, this is the lip gloss. So, all I do is, same thing we've been doing with the lashes. Go in, get one, it says KR Collection. Okay, I, I put my finger through it, I shouldn't have did that. So all I do is basically I'm gonna drop it and which everyone lands like away from me, I'm gonna put the label on that side. And you just stick it on there. Smooth it out. Smooth it out. And there you go. our collection hmm. I don't know if they're backwards or not so I'm going to show y'all how it looks on the pink one and that's about it and that's it that's all you gotta do so Corona is not stopping nothing around here we still gonna launch these businesses we still gonna sell we just gonna take extra precautions, but I feel like honestly, if you run a business, you should have already been taking those precautions. Like you should already been sanitizing your products and disinfecting your, you know, packaging and all that. So that's no problem. Um, as far as the lip gloss, of course I sanitize my area. I sanitize the tubes when I get them, so I soak them in water, antibacterial soap. Like I clean them. And then even when I'm done, you know, I sterilize everything, make sure I use new things every time I use them. Like, I'm not reusing things. Gloves every time you settle in with something that goes in, like, people's mouths, eyes, whatever. So, um, I hope you guys support me with my new business, K World Collection. Uh, it's not really new. I just upgraded it. I changed the names from K World Couture to K World Collection. Um... So, like I said, we sell lashes, lip gloss. I'm going to go ahead and tell y'all I was selling selfie lights and then also jewelry as well. But the jewelry won't come until after because I had a vendor, but the vendor kind of fell through. Which is why you should always have more than one vendor for your objects, by the way. When you're working in the industry, you always want to make sure you have more than one vendor because... You never know you may think you have a relationship with a vendor but then they may like stop contacting you or something may happen in that area for my sake i ordered the products from the vendor the selfie light cool he shipped it he's also u.s based so i was like okay great but for some reason the shipping in his particular area is like taking forever to say like we're both in the united states also with my other vendor with my jewelry that fell through i ordered it then I was like, oh, we can't do express shipping right now. So I canceled the order and I ordered it with another vendor. And they were able to give me the express shipping. However, their lead time takes about three to five days. Normally with my lash vendors and my makeup vendors, I send them what they want. And they'll literally send me a picture of what I ordered that same day. Unless it's like custom packaging or something like that. But like other than that, so I was just like, dang. So... I was a little sad that I wasn't able to have everything on the site. But that's cool because in my head, I feel like you're going to be like, oh, this is what she's selling. And then boom, I'm going to drop some new products on the website. So I'm going to show you guys what I have so far. Um, I actually decided to just put the labels on the outside of the lashes simply because... um. I didn't like the way they looked inside of it. Like it looked it weird. So here's one. We have Bombshell. We have Miami. And we have Wifey. Oh, and we have Hollywood. So those are the ones I got so far. Um, 
like I said, I am disinfecting every packaging. Right now, I'm just taking a break, but um, that's what I have so far. I do need to um order some more labels because I already know I don't have enough. And the Avery labels actually took a little minute to get here. I don't know why. And then I also took some pictures of the lashes. I need to upload those to my website. Because I already have like little cute stock pictures. But I want to actually have pictures of the lashes as well. But I'm just going to use those as secondary pictures so I can keep the flow. I already signed in. So you know these were um my previous orders are ready so i'm gonna go here i wonder if i go to reorder is it gonna let me proof it first or yes so all i did was click reorder That looks about right. So now that I did that, this is how they're gonna look. So I'm gonna just go ahead and I'm gonna hit let us print for you. Okay, I'm ready. I'm gonna save this one. I'm gonna just say LG labels. I'm gonna save it. Double check. I'm gonna view the pre PDF proof. All right. Dang, that thing says it's gonna be May twelfth. And there's a long order in it now. I should have did this last time because when I ordered them earlier, when I ordered them last time, they told me it was going to be here within a week. And it was not here within a week. But actually, the day it told me it was supposed to ship to me is when they started doing production on it. I'm just about to go ahead and put the finishing touches on my website and I'll probably release this video um the day I launch so yeah it's probably May 4th right now happy launch matter of fact I am going to release this video this video by the time y'all see this video it'll be May 4th the website will be up make sure you go to shop krk dot com get you some lashes get you some gloss baby it got keychains on the gloss and stay tuned for the jewelry i'm not gonna tell y'all what kind of jewelry just stay tuned for it so yeah that's it y'all i'm excited so like comment subscribe and shop and i'll see y'all in the next video deuces can't even look deuces don't even look right ain't got no nails no nothing